seriously, I, I think their offense might struggle in the red zone because they don't have as much room to run their passing routes. 1,700 yards for the season for him. He sends Mills in motion to his right, Wilson to the left, Ronapo looking right, steps up, pressure coming, Terhune hit as he throws, and that's an incomplete forward pass as Terhune found his way in. And this is from the dead center of the field, a 41-yard try, snap is back, ball is down, kick is low, very, very low, and the kick sails wide to the left, no good. And they go without a huddle, first and 10 from their 36, fake to Mills, throw it down low to Sharp. He is stacked up in the backfield, and he is wrapped up at the 30, a loss of five. Now James again sprints to the backfield, the turn and the fake. Now the pitch to James, wide of the numbers, cuts inside, makes a very good cut across the 40. He got a very big chunk of it back. That's the second. James goes in motion from the 35. Bolas fakes to him, rolls near side. Cuts up, and a lot of running for Bolas. Now reverses field and has some room, 40. 45 midfield, 45 of UMass, 40 of UMass, and out of bounds he goes. Boy, Bolas really made a play happen right there. Simmons is lined up in the backfield, and Bolas will fade, he'll step, he'll throw, and Simmons leaps and got both feet in for the first down inside. So the snap is back, the ball is put down, and the kick is on its way, and the kick is good. And Shane Hines has put the golden flashes in flight here in New England. Second down and 10, flashes trailing by seven end around on the reverse James needs one block cuts inside now back outside got to the 40 and then he's run out of bounds for a first down game down seven they spread two wide outs to the right Bolas will take the snap he's gonna put it up he lobs it and it is caught at the goal line by Chandler for a touchdown Rolling his front apple, pursuit behind him. He throws it, picked off by Cuthbert. Midfield, far sideline, and he's going to spin back near side this time. 45 40, still dancing around. And he is still on his feet and finally wrapped up after a long run back. You no, know, it's the same thing. It's 0 0, right? Yep. Yeah. 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 0 0. Again, all we got to do is what we know how to do, okay? And that's play our game. One play at a time, that's it, all right? That's it, but you gotta make plays. You gotta make plays, and no bad, no my bad plays in the second half. Everybody got me? Yes, sir. All right, let's go win the game. Hell yeah. That's it. Hell let's yeah. go, let's go, get in here. Yes, let's go, let's go. Here we go, win the day on three. One, two, three. Win the day. Let's go. So they'll stack two wide outs in the slot, roll Bolas this way, still rolling, stops. Cuts back to the far side and has some room. He's to the 30, he's to the 25, and that is a George Bull, his first down run. Hines will look to give Kent State its first lead, a 39-yard kick as the wind dies down. Kicking into the shade, snap is back, it's put down, the kick is on its way, and the kick is good. And the goal will go into the shotgun with a running back, Lorenzo Woodley, to his right. He's going to throw or try to. Steps up, pressure coming, and they get pressure on him and bring him down for a sack at the 21. 10, UMass from its own 15-yard line. And Fronapple will go back to the ground game, and it's a big, big hit. And here comes Fronapple. He'll pitch it, and they're going to throw it back to Fronapple. He sets up. He is going to step up now and be brought down way in the backfield at the 45. As that Here is the snap back and a high, high kick coming inside of the 15. Bounce, bounce inside the five and waiting right at the two to scoop it up. Reasons unknown, so call it second down and eight. They'll have thrown ample throwing before the series. So. They've got three men in the backfield. Now they send out sharp and motion to the right. And from the end zone, Fronapple turns, play action. He's going to put it up, fading, fading, fading. He's out of bounds. He's out of bounds, it looked like. They're going to confer here. It looked like from the naked eye, he stepped out. Yes, he did. Call it two. And Kent State leads by five. Sharp will line up from the right now. He'll come out to the left where he's matched up against Monday. What a matchup that could be. Here's the snap, and they're going to run it to the edge from the outside, and Monday comes off the block, and he smothers that ball carrier back behind the line of scrimmage. He calls for the snap. He'll take it and look right. Now middle, flush from the pocket. 
He breaks, he fires high, an incomplete far sidelines and no flags. And an incomplete pass on fourth and five with 137 to go. We'll bring Kent State's offense back out. And they're gonna spot the ball. One more kneel down and there it is from George Bolas. And the final 20 seconds will tick away. It's a KSU KO of UMass here in New England. Kent State a winner by a score of 15 to 10. We, go to we talked about going on the road. We've been 0 and 8. All right, not anymore. Correct. Yeah. Yeah.